Oh ho ho! Thought you could surprise me with that disguise, huh? Uh, wait a minute. You're not a... You're... Who are you? I am number 86, Kids Next Door Head of Day Commissionin, and I am about to put your pathetic behind out of commission! Pathetic? But, uh, but... I'm the most powerful, most fearsome villain of them all! Ah, stop your wine and sewer breath and let's get on with it! You don't have a chance against my toilet paper grenades, number 86! <laughs> I recycled the paper myself! You can't do that! I'm a big time villain! Hey, that's my flushing hand! Ha ha! I can't fail! Mustard? <laughs> my toilet paper is more absorbent than that, number 86! <laughs> Soon, my terrifying toilets will be fully installed and plugged to the rim with industrial strength toilet paper! What are you yapping about now? Um, I'm going to uh, flood the treehouse with... But I didn't ask what your stupid plan was, now did I? Oh, you're in my bowl now, jerk! <laughs> Duh! Leave it to a boy to spend his time making artsy hit effects and explosions when he should be spending it coding better AI! What were you thinking, number two? Yeah! Just you wait, number 86! With a few more of my toilets installed, you'll get to meet my new unflushable scummy mommies! Come on! Don't you have any better opponents in this training simulation, number two? I'd get as good a train in fighting the dandelion as fighting the toilinator. Good riddance! You call this a training session, number two? How are you supposed to train an operative when your simulator couldn't even challenge a baby? But I'm a super villain! Facing me should be a super challenge, right? Uh, anybody? Ah! Uh, if you boys can't shut off this loser's whining, I'm gonna do it myself! Uh-oh. Ah! Only that disgusting lardball Grandma Stuffum would have the nerve to violate the Sprinkle Puff Donut Shop! Oh ho ho! Soon, number 86, skinny children around the world will have my delightful liver and spinach pastry cream dripping down their chins and fingers covered in delicious anchovy sprinkles! Ah, stick a spark in it, stuff em. You'll be done soon enough! Spinach? Liver? Olives? What's next? Haggis donuts? Oh, for Pete's sake! Not even Grandma Stuffum needs such a ginormous oven! Oh, ho, ho, skinny girl! Why eat so many tiny donuts when just one of my fantastic mega donuts can plump you up so nicely? Fat chance, Stuffum! As long as the kids next door are here, your deep fried plans will never succeed! Oh, but I will! And my nutritious spinach soldiers will see to it that you do not interfere! <laughs> Don't be such a wimp! Ow! Come on, stuff em. If you can't take the heat, it's time to get out of the kitchen! Actually, even if you can't take the heat, you should still get out of the kitchen! Blech! Oh, you sweet, albeit rude, little girl. You'll never make it out of my oven uncooked. Well, it's about time. A staircase made of slimy spinach-infested donuts is as good as any if it gets me out of this oven. I'm coming for you, stuff em. Aw, oh, now come on. Does everything in this place have to be ridiculously huge? How am I going to reach those stupid platforms? Ah, a river of disgusting donut batter! Grandma Stuffum can make enough spinach and liver donuts to fatten up all the kids in the world with this! Your attempt to deny kids their sprinkle puff donuts is unconfectionable, Stuffum! The right of the children to eat sugary sweet donuts shall not be denied! 
Oh, but I don't want to deny them the donuts number 86. I want them to eat lots of donuts. My donuts! Ah, spare me the flower power, Stuffum! Drop the spoons, ladies, and get out of my way! I don't have time for any taste testing! So, haven't had enough of Grandma's cooking yet, I see. Keep your haggis to yourself, Stuffum, and step away from the cheese grater! Oh, ho, ho. but I'm afraid you haven't cleaned your plate yet, my skinny scarecrow. Not to worry, my chunk wagon has just this thing to help you children put some meat on your bones! I told you, lady, I won't be eating any haggis! Stuff may have a thing for donuts filled with liver and onions, but jelly? Now that's different! And flip that switch to operate the injector mechanism! Ha! What good is a protective shield if it won't even hold up to jelly, Stuffum? Now, how about some mustard with that? Out of my way! All right, Stuffum, don't make your prison slop any colder than it has to be! Now get to moving! Well, well, I'm surprised to see you come for a spanking, number 86! <laughs> Don't bother shooting at my hand of justice minions! I assure you, the darkness makes them quite invulnerable to your attacks! Nice try, Count, but I'm here to shed a little light on your operation! Reach for the sky, butt whoopers! There'll be no more children paddled while I'm around! Oh, stop your whining! Weapon set for ouch! Oh, my word! That servant of spankiness is paddling that kid like there's no tomorrow! I've gotta stop him! Step away from the hiney, Spankenstein! Now we'll see who the better girl is! Now to finish rescuing those kids' behinds from Spanky Lot's butt-busting helpers! So, you want to do this the hard way! Never send a boy to do what a girl can do better! Oh no, number 86! Such naughty children cannot go unpunished! <laughs> so, number 86, what is it that brings you to this neighborhood tonight? Hands where I can see him, Count! You've busted one too many bottoms tonight, and now I'm here to bust you! But, uh, but, 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 but. No buts about it! Yours belongs in a prison cell! If I can't shine some light down here fast, I'm gonna get my hiney spanked! There's got to be a way to re-aim those spotlights on the clock tower! Time's almost up, Count! And you're running out of henchmen! The only thing I'm in the running out of is patience for your smart remarks, naughty girl! Ah, your little spanking crusade may be over, Count, but on the bright side, at least you'll be spending the morning in a nice, dark prison cell! One more word, spanky lot, and you'll be peeling garlic in the Arctic prison cafeteria! Attention, Sector 5, this is number 86. I've got the Count and I'm bringing him in! Um, okay, number 86, but I'm upgrading the cool bus and I, I sort of don't have room for him yet. Do you think you could maybe hang out with him a bit until... No, I can't hang out with him, number two! Gah! We'll just have to stick him in cold storage and haul him to Moonbase when we've caught the others! Gah! Boys! 86 out! <gasps> the cavity cave! Those little maggots with wings might not be so bad after all! Night Brace's bug butt toothpaste won't be forced on the children of the world if I can help it! So, this is the so-called main computer, is it? What a piece of junk! And he plans to ship his disgusted toothpaste around the world with this? Well, I am taking your little tooth polishing operation offline, brace face! Weapon set for ouch! Ah, stupid passcodes! And even stupider jingle! <sighs> no matter, I'll find them. Maybe this other terminal can help. Ah, the 
this computer doesn't even work. If it had power, I might be able to get a passcode out of it. Huh. Now where does that power line go? You're kidding me. Somewhere out there are a lot of old folks missing their teeth, and they're not gonna find them because I have to blast them to complete my mission! Ha! That's one down, three more to go. Now, on to the next computer terminal. Hmm. That gate has been electromagnetically sealed. I'll have to short-circuit it somehow. Aha! Nightbase must use this control panel to command his Denta drones. If I can gain control of a drone, I bet I can guide it to short out that circuit. Well, I like rainbow monkeys as much, if not more, than the next girl, as kids next door head of day commission and I don't have time for this! Just as I suspected, the headgear has shorted out part of the gate. Four more drones should be enough to get it open. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting you, number 86. My appointment book shows number one. So many children in need of braces, you know. But for you, I'm sure I can find a few spare moments to kill. Or should I say, to drill? <laughs> Shut your cavity, night brace, or else you're gonna be rinsing and spitting mustard from this here musket! My shots are useless, and I'm getting the cavities drilled out of me. Maybe if I tried attacking night brace from behind. So, this is the so-called main computer, is it? What a piece of junk! And he plans to ship his disgusted toothpaste around the world with this? Well, I am taking your little tooth polishing operation offline, brace!